All right, let's move over to the men. I'll go first. This one was hard because there was an athlete I had on the on the roster, and then I took him off, then I put him back on, then I took him off. But I decided to go chalk, and I'm going with Marvin Bracey Williams leadoff because he's a great starter. Trayvon Bommel on the back leg, Christian Coleman on the curve, and then Fred Curley to anchor. I think a lot of people are going to probably put Curley on that second leg because typically you put your strongest runner on the second leg. But Curley needs to be the star. Jamaica doesn't run Usain Bolt on leg two. They put Usain Bolt on the anchor. <laughs> putting Fred Curley on the anchor. Let him cross the finish line in victory, hopefully. We'll see. So, yeah, I'm going Bracey to Bromel to Coleman to Curley. All right, and the reason why... I go Bracey to Bromel. They're training partners. So that first handoff, they can practice every day together in Florida. <laughs> and there'll be no if, ands, or buts that that first exchange will be perfect. Yeah. You assume that they're going to have the lineup straightened up before we get there. Okay. I got th this. Like I said, I have three options for this one. Ready? <laughs> Option one. This is the consistency option. And even, so I think in general, you have five guys for four spots. You have the four that you mentioned, the 100, plus Lyles. And the reason Lyles is in there is because he's been on the team in the past. You can't discount it. And it just, you know, him with the flying start, it, he's a legit threat. For in that, in that the viewers, you're talking about Noah Lyles, not Josephus Lyles. No allows. No allows. Correct. So, yeah, Bracey Williams, uh, Bromel, Curly, and uh, who am I skipping? Who am I missing here? Coleman. Excuse me. So, here's option one, which is consistency. The consistency option. Um, you keep two, three, four the same. Curly on the backstretch. Lyles on the curve. Bromel anchor. And then the leadoff is either Coleman or Bracey. Now, again, I think a lot of this is going to be based on the, the 100, don't you? If for some reason one of those guys goes out in the first round of the 100, are you going to be confident? And another guy makes it all the way through to the final. Like, are you going to be sticking with the guy who went out in the first round who didn't look that good? So I, I think just based on what we have right now, Coleman or Bracey on that opening leg, then Curly, Lyles, and then Bromel. Option two, all right, rest. This is considering consistency plus rest. So consistency plus rest. Who's the guy who's going to be running the most this weekend? Fred Curly. This week, yeah. So in this option, and again, this would not be my first choice because I think he can handle it, but the 200 is the night before the prelim. So, all right, rest him for the prelim. So go Coleman, Bromel, Lyles, Bracey, and then sub out Bracey for Curly the next day in the final. And then go Coleman, Bromel, Lyles, Curly. So you're just swapping out the anchor leg, which is what they did in 2019. They had Cravon Gillespie there, and then they subbed, subbed him out. All right, option three. Here's what I think is going to happen. Here's what I think is going to happen. And I don't think this is the right option. But here's what I think is going to happen. I think they're going to swap out the entire back half of the lineup. Because Lyles and Curley, theoretically, are both going to be in that 200-meter final the night before. And they're going to get worried. Right? Because in my previous option, I have Lyles running in the prelim, even though he ran the 200 the day before, and I don't have Curley. Because Curly had the 100 as well, too. Yeah. Um, but you could say, all right, we're going to be super conservative in terms of rest. Anybody who ran that 200 final is not going to be on the prelim. In which case, you have Coleman or Bracey lead off. Bromel, Eli Hall, Tyree King. Now, you could also say you're going to put Coleman and Bracey in there. So you could go, you could do something like Coleman, Bromel. Eli Hall, Bracey, but some, some variation of that. And then you get to the final, and then on third and fourth leg, then you put in Lyles, and then you put in Curly. I think that's how it's going to end up 
going and it's going to be frustrating for a lot of people because traditionally that's where this le- that's what this leads me to believe again that's not what i think they should do but i think that's what they will do do they drop it in this hypothetical do they drop the stick <laughs> absolutely absolutely so or maybe they don't drop it but chance they're gonna drop the stick. but 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 there's some sort of issue with with the pass so so you think they're like gonna yours. do they're gonna go they're gonna rest the 200 guys they're gonna go well are they gonna hold on you put are they gonna put two guys in the prelim like colt because you you're gonna say coleman or bracy they're only gonna pick one of those guys yeah, so I have right now Coleman slash Bracey, but if both of them make it to the 100 final and they both look good, let's just say for argument's sake they keep both of them. So then then the order would be they just sub out one guy. So you'd have – you'd go Coleman, Rommel, Bracey, and then Eli Hall runs anchor, right? Or, yeah. or Kyrie King runs anchor. But then you're swapping out the back half of the lineup, just like I said the women did um, at, at, at the Olympics. And then you're going to put in Lyles and Curly. I think you have to have Lyles. I think you have to have Lyles on the team. So I think it's just a matter of, and I think Curly has to be on the team unless something goes horribly wrong. So I think the question is, which two do you pick of the remaining three? And you probably just take the two best guys based on how they finish the 100 and then run that. If USA goes one, two, three, four in the 100, is the fourth place finisher in the 100? Not gonna be on the four by one. Is that fourth place finisher Fred Curley? It's anybody. I think Curley's on it. I think I think Curley's so. on it regardless. I think Curley has to be on it regardless. So Bracey is the, the one who's on the bubble. Bracey and Bormel. Well, I think whoever that third guy is is on the bubble because I think you're yeah. they're gonna go with Lyles and they're gonna go with Curley. I think. They should. I think this one's going to sort itself out because I don't think they're going to go one, two, three, four. I think Curly is going to medal. I think one of the other guys is probably going to medal. And then the other person, the other two are probably going to get, you know, finish a little bit farther back and it's going to, it's going to clarify. However, all that to say, I don't mind your plan because then they know ahead of time, this is the team. And then there's no confusion about it. It doesn't matter if you get first or if you get 15th, we trust you. This is our four. We're going to run this four. Like, I don't mind your four. In fact, I'm signing on to your four. Yeah. Me. I like your four. Let's Thank just you. stick with it. Like, Lyles, just stick with obviously, it. Lyles obviously should, is qualified and, and could do a good job. But we're going – that's option zero for me. That's even more consistent. That's uber consistency with Gordon's plan. I don't, unless someone gets hurt, this is the four. There this we is Because this is what Racy, we talked about before. Romel, Coleman, Kirk. Remember all the stuff we argued about last year? Or not last year. Wait, when was Tokyo? Last year. And they dropped the stick. Carl Lewis went on Instagram Live. Like, things were going crazy. And we just said, just pick five, six, seven, eight after the trials. And they, all they do is practice handoffs. All they do is practice with each other. This isn't the same as that. But it is sort of, hey, let's not let our depth be a detriment to our team. And right now, our depth in some ways is a detriment to the team because it keeps us from knowing who the team is and that limits the ability to develop chemistry and to practice. So let's just settle on that four and go with it. 